Hey friends, Pastor Kevin here. Thanks for joining me. I brought a friend. Yeah, a balloon. Isn't that weird? A balloon. Ha! What does a balloon have to do with us here today? Well, um, I think we need to start doing some thinking here because uh, I think the balloon can help us tell a story. And a very, it's not just a, a story story, it's a for real thing. Uh, I think we all have one of these inside of us, right? We have a heart. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, but we also have what we call our spiritual heart. And the spiritual heart is where we want Jesus to live. But Jesus does, doesn't jump in there. We've got to ask him in. And without Jesus in our heart, we can't get into heaven. He's really the key to get into heaven. Speaking of keys, it's kind of a wonky looking key, isn't it? What, what do we use a key for? It unlocks things, right? Well, we what's the key to getting into our heart for Jesus to get in there? Hmm. Ah, we have to ask him, right? We have to ask Jesus to be our forever friend. And that's pretty simple to do. We have to remember what Jesus did when he died on the cross because he died for your sins and my sins. And unless we say, Jesus, forgive us of those, we still carry them. And that's the good news. When we ask Jesus to forgive us of our sins, he is faithful and just and will forgive us of all unrighteousness. And that way, we get that part clean. But what Jesus told us to do in his word, the Bible, he said, follow me. Hmm, where do we follow him to? We're following him to heaven, but to get there, we've got to do some things here first. And to follow him means we obey what his word tells us. We do as we're told. Uh, in fact, that's what obedience is, doing what you're told when you're told with the right heart attitude. It's doing the commands of Jesus, and that's taking care of others and helping others, loving God with all of your heart, soul, mind, and strength, and loving your neighbor as yourself. That neighbor would include your brother, your sister, or anybody else. We are to be showing them love because God is love. He doesn't he, that's who he is. He is love. He loved us so much that he sent his son, Jesus Christ, to the earth. Jesus grew up. He started as a baby. He grew up. And then one day, he gave his life on the cross for you and me. But if you look at what Jesus did all that time, he loved other people. Now, it's always sad when a balloon gets broken, and you're not supposed to stick balloons in your mouth. But... What Jesus did was he gave his life on the cross for our sins. And when Jesus died on the cross for our sins, before he died, he says, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. It's only by having Jesus in our heart that we get to go to heaven. And the only way to get Jesus in our heart is to invite him in, and then we come follow him. Hey, boys and girls, if you got questions about that, get a hold of Pastor Kevin. He loves talking about this stuff. And uh, Holy Cow will be back soon. He just wanted to uh, let me do the talking tonight and have uh, today and have a different friend, a balloon, to show us that Jesus is the way, the truth, and the life. And to let you know that Jesus loves you just like you are. He loves you enough that he sent, he came, and he died for you on the cross. That's how much he loves you. So now what do we do? We need to love him back and do as he says in his word and come follow him. Thanks, friends. We'll see you next time right here on Pastor Kevin and Friends. Bye-bye.